Hello guys, my name is Shotley and welcome back for another episode of Supreme Ruler Ultimate World Conquest of Bust as El Salvador and we are still fighting the Russians here in Finland mostly but I did realize that there is airfield over there so we need to be a bit careful while taking the Murmansk uh, harbor over there. Also I did realize that we have we haven't taken out that merchant marine yet but we'll probably do it soon. Or at least I hope. And the game is going very slow for some reason. Okay, there we go. We got that one. What's the situation here? This unit needs to be repaired pretty badly, but we don't have barracks nearby. Closest one would be in Olo, I think, and that is a bit too long trip for just that infantry. We are still bombarding the enemy unit trying to get out from the barracks. Then they go back to be repaired, and once they're repaired, they will be spreading out a little bit and so on. And Great Britain is still flying over our airspace, which is a little bit annoying. Okay, there's something going on. Apologies for this, but I'm gonna have to. I can close that one. Now, quickly. Check another thing. No, that's not the issue. Okay, well, hopefully that improves it. it seems to be improving a little bit, maybe. But yeah, there's just so many units in the world, and everything is moving, so that is a bit of an issue. Okay, yeah, that seems to be a hostile spy over there, and I do believe we are... Yes, we are building more troops here. Yeah. Excellent, now we apparently have another escort ship over here ready to be used elsewhere. Are we still producing ships? Yes, we got one more ship on the line over there. And we got escort ship over here that we could possibly send somewhere. Or we can let it stay around here for the time being. Oh, but we got submarines that are still on their way. Okay, it's another recording day, so I tend to forget a little bit of the details. Let's see. Um, you are repaired. I'm gonna send you a little bit forward. And France wants to trade again. I'm okay with that. Frankly, we are losing a little bit of money. Too much though. We have the troops over here that we could. S we know that they got some troops over here, probably a fair bit in that barracks over there, actually. What I could do is I could use my troops to take out that one first. And we'll leave one of the. one over there, send the rest of these. And where is the. No, wait, there's this. Yeah, it's everyone there. Okay, let's send in the artillery a little bit this way so that we can bombard the timber mills if need be. Can we actually set up... Uh, yes, we can set up a bit of a garrison over there. We should help defending and we'll send two of these guys to start taking out the garrison in the next timber mill area here. In the meanwhile, we can try to... Okay, yeah, there's... Uh, we'll probably take a little bit uh, losses here. In terms of manpower, but... Not too much, I hope. But yeah, I was thinking about maybe trying to... Well, there's not much around here. We could try to take out that one. Getting there is going to be a bit of an issue. Unless we have a... L no, we don't have much supplies around here. Right, well, I mean, we do have the recon units at least over here. We'll send them a little bit closer. Yes, yes, I know. Got the artillery over there. Those are defending for the most part right now. I could uh, divide some of the troops around here to make sure that they don't go straight through here. Without us noticing, at least. 
Okay, you can probably go a little bit forward. And you two get over there. Right, I think that should be our next uh, area here. If we can cut this route out, we can send... I wouldn't say easily, but a little bit easier to take out this area. And did we get any extra reinforcements yet? It would appear as a no. You, on the other hand, are part of these units, if I remember correctly. Wait, or is it this way? Oh yeah, it's over here. I'll send you there. Then we can take out maybe those. But I thought we had... Uh, yes, we actually do have some extra troops, so I'm gonna send these into the fight. They'll probably... Actually, I'm gonna send it over here. So they'll help taking out this and starting a bit of a blockade from the railway here, so the enemy can't bring reinforcements as easily. Hopefully it works. I can't really promise that, but I can certainly try. In the meanwhile, let's start making more, I guess, stormers. They are pretty decent troops. They are... In most things, they are better than the IOF-2s, but not in everything. For example, against tanks, they are a little bit worse. But the difference is not huge. The bombardments are doing all right here. We might actually need more artillery, though. Now that I think of it, don't really. Well, we have one set of artillery over here. We got another one over here and one over here. So we got only three sets of artillery on this front, which uh, is probably a little bit too few. We'll probably start moving these troops now, or at least this particular unit. Let's see, so if we combine our troops around here, we can probably take out the village over here and the industry complexes. And then take out the barracks and this area and then we'll basically, yeah, we'll be cutting out the railway. Unit design completed. Escort ship, okay. Lost a little bit of territory, but that was to be expected. Is uh, what usually happens anyway. Where are we shooting down planes again? I thought I heard something, but I could be wrong. Or it might be some other battles going on that are not actually mine. It's a possibility. Okay, let's get this way. I'm gonna combine all these troops here. I don't know, for some reason my it's lagging very hard right now. I don't know why exactly. Okay, we got fair amount of troops around here that we could probably try sending in there, but the thing is, it's forest, so it's going to be very hard getting in there. We don't have barracks or anything around here, but we can fix that. We build a barracks over there. Of course, once we get that, we can fix also in there, but until we get there, I'll wait until the barracks is completed. It shouldn't take more than 20 days, which of course can be a fair amount of time. Let's wait for the artillery to be in position. I'm taking the can already. Start firing, so let's uh, set up here. Take out the garrison as quickly as possible. And actually move the artillery a little bit closer this way. Because I did need to move a bit less when we start fighting the barracks. And these garrisons are going to be dead soon. There we go. I'm going to send these two over there. These two over there. And they're a little bit wounded. A slightly wounded unit will stay where it is right now. 
Right, so do we have... We have a little bit extra units over there, a little bit over there. Not too much though. We've got few over here. But yeah, I mean, we are producing units just... It's gonna take a while. Of course, I... Did my convoy arrive home yet? It might have, or maybe not. No, it's still on its way. Never mind. Alright, so since we got that... Uh, we were sending the extra units this way. Once they arrive, they'll take out the barracks. And they'll... I think I'll use my battle group to go south here and start harassing Helsinki. But yeah, we are certainly wasting a lot of their military goods, I th feel. Let me actually check that real quick. I mean, they had, I think, about, uh, yeah, 180,000 last time, so they've lost a little bit. The question is, uh, have they lost enough? Uh, we still don't have all that much uh, things to research, which is a bit unfortunate. Actually, let's see, can we... I don't remember, did we relieve more than what we have right now in terms of the units? Okay, I can't, can't move you, but can I make you into a battle group? I can. Okay, 118. Excellent. That's gonna make things a little bit easier here. And you are being slowly repaired, but it's very slow. I could make a railway from there to here. Which I might actually do. Of course, once it's ready, we've already gone way past it, and that's a bridge. Oh well. <laughs> Alright, so we're basically just defending over here for the time being. How are we doing around here? We could potentially move a little bit that way. Set up a defense over here instead. And these units can probably move slightly forward. Though I can't promise that it's going to be useful. Let's actually build a couple... Supply depots over there. It should help a little bit on this area here, but of course the effect will be done or will be visible much later on. Okay, so we got these units. Can we actually make these into no, okay. But we can send them here. Send the artillery over there. And we'll take out the barracks hopefully. Okay, there's a fair amount of truth there. I mean, if we move our artillery a little bit close... Oh god, there is a l lot of firepower in those. Yeah, maybe these stormers are not very good in forests. If we can take at least one of them out, that'd be nice. Okay, we took one out. We'll probably won't be able to take out another one. Because these units need to be... repaired. I capture a spy from Great Britain, okay. Yeah, let's just uh, retreat with all the troops. That was a bit uh, expensive attack, but we destroyed one of them. We didn't lose any complete units ourselves, so that's good. Okay, 60 second. Let me move you a little bit this way. We can get another set of artillery somewhere over there. We could send these, actually, to help over here. 
then we can increase the amount of uh, bombardment we can do from there, basically. So if we can start taking out the actual units, that'd be very useful for us. Are we still sinking ships somewhere? I believe we are. I mean, let's send these uh, submarines, for example, over here. These are in need of a repairs, though. But holy crap! Okay, we need to retreat with the artillery a little bit and the stormer. Those are artillery pieces. Yeah, they are. And that's a lot of units. Okay, so it's not gonna be easy. We'll need to move this artillery a little bit closer, I feel. I don't know where he's trying to go, but if we get you a little bit closer, we can probably take it out. Or at least make it uh, retreat. Why don't you actually go there and hopefully you can destroy it? Oh, coming back. Well, we destroyed it. There we go. But it would appear that there's a lot of enemy troops around here. Let me check it out. Satellite available for launch. Yes, please. We are still bombarding the units around here, but it's pretty much. Uh, stuck over there the front for the time being until we get more troops in which uh, technically we could get if we are desperate we do have some supply trucks around here that we could use with the recon units we could then maybe take out that one it's a possibility and then maybe cut that railway okay so light launch confirmed so that means that we got uh, seven satellites already. Which is uh, pretty good. Well, seven communications and three reconnaissance. Goddamn Great Britain. I actually wonder. We move these around a little bit. We can bombard also those units with this artillery. Now that switching around was a pretty good idea, actually. It seems. We'll probably take out that. I have two pretty easy. Oh, they sent a lot of artillery out. Come on, bombard that. Yeah, they are trying to bombard, but... It... Okay, it is a fair amount. We could try to advance a little bit over there to rush them and try to force them back. I think the 208 uh, group will just stay defensive for the time being. Let's get over there. And since it is a uh, military complex, they don't have the defensive bonus as such. Although, we will need to get over there because that mortar might... Put, well, actually it's just a mortar I can't go through, never mind. But yeah, you need to retreat already. 60 seconds, I'm gonna send you over that way. Okay, we are destroying a lot of their units now. They do have the garrisons there, but then will not be holding for long, I don't think. Yeah, there's one... No, all the garrisons are dead now. They're using a lot of units. This is insane. Okay, well, we are going to ignore that. Airbase and Vispy. Oh, right, yeah. Okay, we are running a bit low on supplies here. Yeah? Because we're killing so many enemies. 
Let's actually have a look at the military size now. It was uh, well, okay, it's still the same. Let's have a look at the kill to death ratio of ours. Oh god. Yeah, that's uh, that's quite a bit, to say the least. Okay, I think we need to retreat now. Get more supplies back, but I think that was a pretty successful raid. They still have some units here, but it's mostly artillery. Do we have supplies in here? We do. So it's just a matter of time for them to actually get the supplies they require. And uh, extra artillery should be on their way. Also, what do we have here? Oh, it's extra artillery indeed, yeah. Okay, they, we got three over there, three, three... You know what, since these two are pretty close to each other, I'm gonna send... Three over there. I'm gonna have to keep a little bit of troops in Stockholm, I think. Just in case of uh, emergency. I think one will be enough for the start. Okay, these five I'm gonna have to send to the... front in central Finland, or western Finland rather, here. Oh wow, they're trying to do some bombardment here. And these three will need to go repair. And I'm assuming we got a few units here that are not part of anything. Four storm. Oh right, these were the units over here. Yeah, we'll have to send them back. They should lose the visibility soon, I hope. And if not, we can just send our artillery on the other side a little bit. I mean, we will take them out, that's not the question. And quite frankly... Or well, we'll need to wait for the artillery units to actually arrive. We'll probably have to retreat the supply trucks a little bit so they're not bombarded entirely, but... We are going to force them back. And there was a lot of units there, that we noticed, but we also killed a lot of them. Annihilate it even. Okay, so this front is pretty stable for the time being at least. We use the recon units with the assistance from the supply trucks to try get this uh is it okay it doesn't even have a name. On this map at least. Okay, there's a spy over there, it's a French spy. Oh, it's got artillery. Let's uh, rush in there and take out the artillery and hopefully also the garrisons. Although there's a lot of garrisons, though it might be a bit hard. We're gonna give it a try, though. Okay, yeah, you need to retreat. Yeah, no, I don't think this is going to work. We might be able to take out one or two of the garrisons. Because they don't have much defensive bones. Okay, we destroyed one of the artilleries. Uh, we might actually take this. Although, the air force is not something I'm fond of. Okay, um, how about we just retreat a little bit? Especially with the supply trucks. Okay, we will use one of... lose that one. Yep. Maybe even more. But yeah, the recon units are not really fighting units. Mostly for recon. Okay, we got the other set of artillery here. Let's send you over there. So we can bombard them from two sides. They probably won't be able to see our troops. 
not anymore at least. Okay, we do have one of these that is ready to go back. I mean, soon we can make another attempt at taking them out. Hopefully with more artillery support. Hold on, what? What happened here? Why are you so beaten up? May need to blockade that, or block that route so they can't reach our artillery right away. There's the last carrier, Man on the Moon is only one and a half months away. And there's two artillery, actually artillery and, oh, they do have infantry now, yeah. They might be trying something, but just out of curiosity, I don't know, have they... They have advanced a little bit over here, but they might have lost a little bit. Oh, did they actually... I think they've gained land in here as well. The Germans, that is. Because I'm destroying a fair amount of uh, Russian units. I mean, they declared the war on me. I mean, I would have done it eventually. Okay, we got another set of uh, infantry here, so... Uh, are the... Yes, the remaining two are repairs. So I'm gonna send them down here and then we'll do another attack on Tampere. Ah, oh, come on. Why do you need to attack the supply trucks that hard. I guess we'll have to attack already because this otherwise this is gonna be a bit too harsh. Especially for our artillery units. Okay, 60 second unit get over there. Guys will push in there once we clear it out. Guys push over there. Can we actually get in there? These units need reinforcements. Did they? No, they did not. I'm gonna send these over here instead. You will need to retreat eventually. But we are suddenly destroying a lot of their units. Can't even keep up. Okay, I'm gonna send you back a little bit, and you two, I'm gonna send over here. Let's get our artillery here to bomb out a little bit. Oh, they got T-72s there. Oh, I mean they are destroying, or getting destroyed, but still. Oh crap. I have to send you there and you two also a little bit closer. Oh, oh. I think we just took that uh, land production here. We just forced them out. Okay, well that's good. We might need to wait for a little bit before we can send some of the troops to be repaired there, but that is going to help. Also, where are we? I think we are sinking ships somewhere. It might be over there, over there. Or even here. There's a lot of British uh, Merchant Marine over here. Which is uh, slightly annoying. Because it might very well be the thing that is lagging the game slightly. Let's get in there. We can get this artillery a little bit closer. Also, we can send maybe those three on this side. Stop helping with this battle over here. In the meanwhile, do we have the troops to... well, we kind of do. I'm gonna have to send you back there. But these troops can get over there. I'm gonna try to take out the barracks again here. 
I don't know if there's, there's only two garrisons there, so it should be doable. Although they do have artillery support. And these battles over here are pretty brutal, to say the least. Okay, I'm going to repair you over there. I'm going to repair you as well. These units will need to get repaired as well. But 208, I'm going to send over here to take out that pocket of units. We will survive this. I'm going to repair you over there. I'm going to send you over that way. Wait, aren't they? Okay, they're going further and further. A bit low on supplies, quite frankly, but I guess it's alright. Artillery a little bit closer. 208, I'm going to send you this way. Uh, 87, I think I can start sending you over here to clear out this area. 208, get further this way. We are pushing them out from here at least. Ah, supply depot, another supply depot, and another supply depot. All in one place, of course, but still, it's going to be useful. Let's, uh, re well, actually, we can probably just uh, do the repair of everything in Finland that we conquered. Right, so we got those troops there. Let's start building more units over here. Let's actually get some anti-tank guns. I mean, they got pretty high heart attack. It's, uh... The rest of their stats are not all that stellar, but they should be alright. Taking out the enemy. Okay, let's just keep on going here. I mean, if we can keep the pressure and go all the way to Helsinki, that'd be nice. Although, that will have to wait until the next episode. Because we've run out of time with this one. So if you enjoyed, please don't like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Also check out my Discord and Patreon links down below. But other than that, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.